So now, um, it's time to clear the air, man. There's been a lot going on, and I'm gonna get a lot of shit if I don't ask you. Yeah, go ahead. So, I'm from Philly. It's good. I know you're not racist. Oh, no, listen, brother. No, I, I, was born, I know. Listen, I know. I was born in Puerto Rico, came to America when I was six years old. Mm -hmm. I lived in recent Lehigh before that neighborhood where it is today, North Philly. It was still Polacks and Germans living around there. Okay, I went through hell. I went through hell racism in this country. My parents couldn't even speak in front of nobody Spanish. They just tell you, speak English. And I couldn't, I couldn't understand why they took my mind. My mind used to whisper to us in Spanish in public. Whisper to us. I couldn't even get free lunches in school, and they were free. That's when it was 15 kids in the class. Why do you think I didn't get free lunches? Because I was Latino. There was no Latinos in this country when I was here. That's when 20th and Green down there was all Boricuas. And they took them all out. Now it's those suburbs up there. Okay? I went through racism in this country. I, was, I, I grew up in black neighborhoods. I'm, I'm from Pike, Eighth and Pike, Eighth and Butler. Okay? That's where I'm from. That's a black neighborhood. Okay? I went to black, black, black schools, black neighborhoods. So I didn't have my races. But I fucked me a couple black girls. <laughs> <laughs> But, on, do you, but do you understand, like, to people, for example, in the UK? Huh? For example, to people in the yeah, UK. Yeah, but they talk about me, but they racist too. Mm -hmm. Come but, on, how you gonna they're gonna dirty the water and then drink? They dirty, they racist too. So when you call, how many you champions in Europe? <laughs> American champions. Mm. How many be on star promotion in Europe? American TV. Unless they go out there as an opponent. Yeah. How many you see? That picture on, on, on Instagram, Explore page a couple days ago, 20 Chinese champions. How many Americans you seen on that? So, but do you understand? So like who how, races? Like, huh? you, like you know? Chinese restaurants around here in the hood. Chinese restaurants. Go see their apartments upstairs. See their renting. Empty pigeons live in them. Because they scared to rent to the blacks and the Latinos. Mm -hmm. And you don't know what the hell they sell us. Because you get beef in a, uh, you get barley and beef, and you get a whole lot of beef. But the last time I remember, beef is expensive. How the fuck you get a plate of beef like that with a Barclays? Whatever you call that, Barclay, what the fuck is called? I'm Puerto Rican, see? Beef I'm Latino. Broccoli. Eat beef and broccoli, but you get a whole bunch of beef for $3. How the hell that happens yeah. when the steak is expensive as hell? Come on, when you walk into these motherfucking Chinese restaurants, you smell like cat. Like cat piss. Killing cats in the basement, brother. <laughs> I got real to friends, bro. They told me that shit. They eat that shit here in America. Well, thank you. Call me racist. I'm bringing everything out to the open. They call me racist. I'm going to be a racist. Mm -hmm. I'm gonna be, and we got AK, we getting ready for this war. But my we, team, we got AK 47, we ready. We got fucking ammunition. And motherfuckers wanna go to war. We got guns too, and we ain't scared. We ain't scared, and we not, we not trying to threaten nobody, but we getting ready for the revolution too. We got guns, we got AK, we got machine guns, we got all that shit. So as far as, uh, as, far as Keith Thurman is concerned, you wasn't trying to, you know, um, be racist Listen, towards. brother, he said, I was humble, I spoke, mm. Danny spoke, he, I spoke, his trainer spoke, he got in the mic and said, I'm going to knock you the fuck out, Danny Garcia, I'm going to knock you the fuck out, that's what he said, and I said, you ain't going to knock nobody the fuck out, you bitch ass, blank, mm. that's what I said, <laughs> so why he said he got knocked, he couldn't say, Danny, I'm going to knock you out, he had to say, fuck you up, Danny, I'm going to knock you the fuck out, yeah. So now you talking slam word, now you talking hood shit, now you talking gangster shit, now we got fighting. <laughs> but you're not a racist. Come on, man, you, listen. If I was racist, if I was racist, you think I'd be here talking to you? You wouldn't be in here. Listen, I work for Russians. I know, though. I work for a lot of people. I work for Russians, I work for Pakistanians. I did everything. I sold ice cream, I sold water ice, I did everything. I sold drugs or cocaine. I sold every motherfucking thing in the world. I sold fucking rocks to a fucking crackhead. And I'm not talking about ready rock, I'm talking about rock, like concretes. <laughs> yeah, I sell a motherfucking rock. You know what the rock? Solid rock to a crackhead. Now you can take a motherfucking, you take it, take a motherfucking uh, a salesman to do that. Okay, so concrete, you know what's concrete? Mm -hmm. Not not ready rock, concrete. <laughs> what's the game? I take the motherfucking money with a fucking orange chip gun. By myself. Everything I did it by myself. I ain't never had 20 motherfuckers behind me either. No. Believe that. I'm from the hood, brother. I was training camp. A motherfucker from the hood ain't racist. <laughs> Huh? No, you're yeah, camp is great. Yeah. Camp is beautiful. Eight camp, weeks? We ready to fuck a motherfucker up. Okay. Camp is great. Camp is beautiful. Eight weeks? We 
Now, no, we we, we three weeks away from the fight. We ain't got we have, we have listen. No, I mean, how, I mean, we, have, how long? we just need eight weeks. Okay, That's gotcha, all Danny gotcha, need, eight gotcha. weeks. But Danny don't blow up. Is anything in Danny particular? Danny don't blow up 300 pounds, 400 pounds. Danny ain't a straight athlete, bro. He don't blow up like them cows, blow up cow problems and shit. We don't got cow problems. What is his walk around weight? Danny walk up like 150, 155, 156, yeah. 157. No, you talking. Listen, Danny is a bigger man at 47, believe it or not. You know why? Because Keith Thurman been 47 since 2008. Since back then, I remember in the amateur. So a bigger man would have been grew out of that weight. He's still fighting 47. We fought 40. Okay? In the Olympic trial, we fought 41. Because there's no 47. You got to jump to 52. But they took 47. You know why they took 47 away from the Olympics? Because the Americans were meddling in the 47. So other countries didn't want America to medal. So who's racist? <laughs> God bless America, brothers. Everybody's scared as fuck of Donald Trump trying to make this country better. What the fuck is wrong with this shit? They call me racist. The fuck with that bullshit, racist shit. You think we gonna fuck a motherfucker? That's what we gonna do. I'm cursing because I'm fucking mad right now. Cause motherfuckers ain't gonna stop me. The only one that can stop me is God. I don't give a fuck about nobody else. That's the only. That's the only one. That can stop me. I don't give a fuck about this bullshit politics shit calling me racist. They can suck my ass and this mother this motherfucker has steak. You wanna see this motherfucking ass? Kiss that fucking ass, bitches! <laughs> fucking faggots. <laughs> fuck out of here. Motherfucking faggots. Angel. Angel. What's that? I'm done, man. Fuck.